There's that right there. Hello, uh, Madison here with Beauty Budget Moms, and I am going to be showing you how I used this Turvix hair tool to get this awesome lightweight crimped look. This tool has a few different functions that it has and it has also different plates that you can use, different sizes. I use the bigger size. I'm going to show you here in a second when I started the uh, the different sizes and how you can actually change the plates. So I used the larger one but I love this. It's such like a fun different look and it took me literally five minutes. It was so easy and I highly suggest it if you want to have like a cute crimped look. It also does come with a flat iron plate so it could use for two different things. If you haven't yet, subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you here. Ashley and I are sisters and we do a lot of beauty videos, hair tools, makeup, skincare. Uh, we also do a lot of fashion try-ons all from Amazon for our two-day threads account. So we'd love to have you here and let's get started. Okay, so this is the Turvix and this is pretty simple to put together. There are so many different uh, levels of the zigzag kind of crimped look. So I'll show you here is like the pink one I believe is the smallest. So if you're going for a really, really crimped, really small, those are small. It looks like these are the medium, the gold. And I'm going to be doing the purple, which is a little bit larger. They also have a flat iron option. So you can also use this as a flat iron, which is pretty awesome. It's two in one. And I love that it comes with different sizes of the crimped look that you're going for. So how to put them on is um, actually pretty easy. You just want to make sure that you are putting it on so that these zigzags line up. So... I'm going to put it on in here. There's like two slots. You put it through there and you just push in. And then I'm gonna check and make sure that this works. And actually I didn't, I didn't do it the right way. As you can see, it's not shutting all the way through. So I'm going to do it again and I'm gonna turn it around. And there we go. See how that's shut all the way. It fits perfectly. So once you do that, you put the outside on and it holds the plate in place and it's locked in place. When you're doing that, if you want to wear the glove, you can. This is not hot right now, so I'm not using the glove. However, taking off the outside can be a little bit difficult, I found. This side was easier. I had a hard time with this side and I noticed if I kind of adjusted the plate up a little bit, it helped me get it out. But wearing the glove helped because it was kind of starting to hurt my thumb. So keep that in mind that it might be a learning curve taking off one of the sides, but I noticed when I adjusted the plate a little bit, it helped me take it off. Okay, so I'm gonna heat this up. And the cool thing is that this does have <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five settings. It goes all the way up to 430 degrees and all the way down to 280. So if you are someone who you want to, if it takes a lot to crimp your hair or curl your hair, you might want the higher setting. However, it really doesn't take much to crimp your hair. These are so small, even these bigger ones, they're so small that it really does not take much to get that crimped look. So I'm going to let this heat up all the way and then I will show you how this baby works. I'm gonna be separating my hair. I have this lower section here that I'm starting with. I am using the Chi Iron Guard a hair protectant spray. I use this one often just when I am flat ironing or putting any heat on my hair after it's dry. And I'm gonna put on the glove just in case. Just like, literally, you just need the lightest touch to get that crimp. And hopefully I can show you a good angle. I'm just gonna barely press down. And I have that crimp right there. And I barely pushed it down. You really don't need much. It is not like the bigger barrel curlers where you have to have it sit for a while, like a regular curling iron. This really does not take much, and it is super easy. And again, you gotta make sure those plates are lined up, otherwise this isn't gonna do anything. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, so let's see if you can see some of that, like that crimp right there. Okay, we're gonna go into the next section. Let's see, I'm gonna do kind of smaller sections. Okay, let's see here. You can hear my kids. How's summer going for you guys? Mine's going okay. There's that right there. Just barely tap down, squeeze a little bit. And it really, really doesn't take much. And there's that crimped, crimped look, so easy. No more little braids. Okay, let's go over here. Perfect. It's light. And again, you can make those tighter. They have those smaller plates if you want a tighter looking crimp. I just wanted the, the larger ones today. The nice thing too is like, I didn't just wash my hair. I, my hair is like three days, like it was, I washed it I think three or four days ago. So this is like a really good look to do as well if you're kind of just trying to switch up the hairstyle on like day two, three or four, even five, you know, use some dry shampoo and gives it a different style for that day. I'm gonna work my way up, but before I forget, do have a exclusive promo code for the Turvex for the crimper slash flat iron. So definitely check that out in the description below. I'll put that down there along with the link for this. Yeah, so I'll work my way up and get back on. Okay, so I'm now up here at the top and I'm actually just about to do my last section. I'm gonna part my hair over to the side now. I had a middle part and now I'm moving over. I just feel like with this hairstyle it would look a little bit better if it is not right in the middle. Kind of give me more of a 80s look. Okay, I just gotta like force my hair to stay over because it's so used to that middle part right now. Okay, so I definitely have that crimped, kind of messy look going and it was so easy. This literally took me like five minutes. This was no time at all and again, I'm using kind of the larger zigzag plates so if you're wanting a tighter, tighter zigzag crimp look, go for those smaller plates, but yeah. This was like super easy, cool tool to have. Honestly, I have four daughters, so I'm really excited to use this on them. I know they're gonna love it. They're gonna, they love having different kind of hairstyles. So, totally awesome. Thanks again for being here with me. I hope this video was helpful and maybe gave you an idea of a different hair tool that you might wanna use. Don't forget to check out that special promo code down below. That's not gonna last forever. So don't wait on that. And thanks for being here and we will see you next time.